The next one is just showing different attacks or different defenses to the angle one and angle two. So it goes in angle one, and I can pass. Okay, it goes in uh, uh, angle which is an angle two, and I can pass here. It's very dangerous, or it's more dangerous than the other one, but it is possible. Um, you can pass here as he pulls it back. You can go to an Aikido wrist lock or a block throw. The point I'm trying to make here is that's the art bit. Everything else is based on self protection. Okay, so this will save your life. If you, get, if you train this, the chances of getting that are very, very remote. Even for somebody who's not looking and you can do that with the funky lock stuff. And then the last bit, if we, if we get time, is the same as the first drill. So he goes to the stag and he pushes through, and I'm just going to control here. He's trying to get um, John on the floor, okay? So I can grab the neck here, or I can just keep here, and I can rotate round, okay? So I get down, and he's on the floor. And then I can use a suitable response. And this is what we'll refer back to um, Section 3 of the Criminal Law Act, as in what is reasonable in the situation that breaking his arm probably is, disarming the knife and getting him to stand his own head is probably.